Good morning, brothers and sisters. This is T. I come to you in my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ's name. Yeshua HaMashiach. I want to share with you a dream that the Lord gave me um, yesterday. It had two parts. I wasn't 100% sure that the first part went with the dream. I kind of do think it did, it did, but I only feel led to share the second part. So I'm just going to jump right in to what the Lord was showing me. Okay, so I'm in a grocery store and the lights were out and people are in there moving very slow. Bro Justin and another brother was with me, but then it's like Bro Justin was making a video for me to see, explaining something that he figured out. So while he was explaining what he figured out, it's like everything in the store stopped and I was able to watch him. I saw him with these clear packets that you can pour liquid in and he poured some bright orange liquid into one of the packets. And then he poured lime green liquid in another packet, another clear packet. And he placed both packets. Excuse me. And he placed both packets in a bigger clear packet that can fit both inside. He put the orange color in the bottom and a lime green on top of the orange. Then he grabbed a light and shined it on the lime green part. And he squeezed the orange and the green with his two fingers and axed. Do you see it? Can you see it? And I saw that the lime green and the orange looked as, as if it was mixed to make the liquid look look like a full green ooze color, like off the Ninja Turtles. So I understood he was showing this. I understood that he was showing this was what they were doing. And I thought to myself, mutants, like they're Ninja Turtles. Now it's no longer looking like a video and everything in the store is moving. And these people were walking like zombies. And me, Justin, and the other brother was moving was moving slow as well to fit in. And I saw Justin had uh, had a bottle, had a bottle of barbecue sauce in his hand, holding it like a paddle and hitting his other hand with it. And he was going to hit the people with it if they began to trip. We were talking, we were talking, and the plan was for us three to get out to get out of the store quick before they notice we're not like them. And once we got to the end of the aisle and able to see the front door, just take off running fast because the zombies will be coming after us. So I thought, man, let me get something in my hand first, see if I can find a baseball bat in here. But we were in a grocery store. So we were passing the meat section and I thought to grab a slab of ribs to slap them with. Then I saw these huge bottles of barbecue sauce and I grabbed two of them. It was like the, the gallon, the gallon thing of, to where you have to hold it like that. It was like a gallon. I saw these two huge bottles of barbecue sauce and I grabbed two of them, carrying one in each hand. I noticed how us three were on the same aisle together, but yet separated because them two were on one aisle and there was a floor cooler that went down the aisle. So I don't know if you've been in a store and you saw, um, how you can be on the same, they'll have the, the aisle, but they have like this floor cooler that run all the way to the front of the store and, and, and they be having like meat and stuff inside there. So it's like we was on the same aisle, but they was on this side and I was on that side. Um, yeah. And we kept moving slow and once we got to the end of the aisle and saw the front door, Justin said, get it. And me and the other brother knew that meant to book it and run fast. So all three of us start running fast. And I began hearing Michael Jackson beat it, beat it, playing in my spirit while running. I saw the other brother was in front and Justin was in the middle. And I was last. And I thought Justin didn't even look back to see where I was. Because he was like, he was just getting it. So he didn't even check, you know, look back for me. Um, and I, and, oh wait, where I was didn't even look back to see where I was and they had a straight shot to the door and I was separated and I had to run from around the side I was on and when the people walking like zombies saw me running they started coming coming from every direction in the store after us and we was running to get to the front door I was I was still carrying the two huge bottles of barbecue sauce and I was thinking I'm gonna make them feel this because I'm gonna bat all their heads off we got outside in the parking lot and they were coming they were coming out of the store fast and we ran to the car and I was the last one and I jumped and slid across the hood of the car and jumped inside of the drop top and we left. Okay, so this was the dream that I was given. Um, 
And the main thing that stood out to me in this dream was, uh, I had underlined it, was the part with Justin, like he was explaining in a video, and he took and he grabbed a clear, a clear packet and he put, you know, some orange liquid inside and then he took and he put green liquid inside of another one and he took both of those and placed inside of a, a, a bigger packet. Uh, and then he shines light on it, you know, basically saying, well, the color had changed to a full green color or whatever. And he shined, yeah, he shined the light on it and it made the color change or whatever. So um, that's the main thing that was standing out to me in his dream. And so what I believe the Lord was um, was showing me was that basically he was shining a light on what's being done in the dark. And according to the dream, we see that something is being mixed together and placed inside of a vessel that can hold both to create or transform them into mutants. Oh, but it was moving like zombies. So, but yeah, so maybe it's a mixture of both. I also believe, you know, what the law was giving me understanding was that giving me understanding of the more I was looking at it. Um, I believe that the orange clear pa packet was like a specific spirit. So maybe this this could be like a spiritual understanding that the Lord was giving me, although this is happening in a natural too, but this was the spiritual sense that I received or the spiritual understanding that I understood, understood or whatever. But I believe that the orange clear packet was a specific spirit and it could be the harlot spirit. And a lime green is another kind, um, maybe like the, uh, the spirit of the fallen being joined together in one, as one inside of a person that can hold both. And it transformed the person, basically making the person like, um, like a child of what's, of, uh, like a child of, you know, the outcome of what been mixed, basically. Um, and I also see a double portion, but a double portion of the fake portion. And I say that because this is how, this is what I saw, like, I had put some stuff in some Ziploc bags to kind of give you, let you see the way I saw it. Okay, so I hope this don't race. <laughs> so, um, like this was like the orange liquid. Yeah, I know it's not orange. Let's not. Okay, so this is the um, this was the orange liquid that was put inside of a clear um, packet, and this was the yeah whatever. But this was the lime green liquid that was put inside of a clear packet. So from what I'm understanding that these both are some type of spirit or whatever. They both, this is a this is a portion of a spirit. This is a portion of a spirit, but it's not a God spirit. <laughs> so then they take both of these, wait, I think this was the orange at the bottom. You take both of these and you place it into a bigger clear packet, which is an actual human vessel. Somebody that can hold both. And once both is inside of them, it transforms that person. I guess, you know, it mixes, they made the color, you know, green like ooze, which transformed that whole, that person, which created a whole nother being, which basically is like, this is, their child. <laughs> this is this is what they birthed. Once the two was mixed together, this is what's being birthed. This new transformation or whatever. Um, I hope y'all follow me with this. But this that's the spiritual understanding that I received from it. But I do believe that this is something happening in the natural that's too you know to being mixed or whatever. And um, and like I said, I believe that it is the horlet spirit. Or whatever. Um, and the scripture that I was led to was um, Hosea 4.12. My people ask counsel at their stocks and their staffs declare it unto them. For the spirit of whoredom has caused them to err and they have gone a whoring from under their God. And the other scripture that the Lord led me to was Genesis 6, 1 through 4. And it came to pass when men be began to multiply on the face of the earth and daughters were born 
unto them that the sons of God saw the daughters of men that they were fair, and they took them wives of all which they chose. And the Lord said, My spirit shall not always strive with man, for that he also is flesh, yet his days shall be an hundred and twenty years. There were giants in the earth in those days, and also after that, when the sons of God came in unto the daughters of men, and they bare children of them. The same became mighty, mighty men, which were of old men of renown. So if we look at this, we can see this as, based off that scripture, we can see this as the daughters and the sons of God. They came into, you know, became one, and they bear children, which is this new thing that, um, that was created, like that, that turned into green ooze, and I thought of mutants. So that's the understanding that the Lord gave to me um, from this dream. So I do ask that y'all do take this, this uh, dream to the Lord in prayer and receive your own confirmation and to make sure that it is from the Lord. Don't just accept what people tell you and just run with it. Always seek the Lord on all things. Um, and with that being said, um, I pray that y'all have a blessed day and always, uh, ask for, I mean, say always ask for forgiveness of your sins and repent, 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 repent for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. God bless.